Hey, how are we all doing? Welcome to this Enlight Video Leap tutorial. In this Enlight Video Leap tutorial, I'm going to show you how to animate your logo um, or make a watermark on your videos, a little bit like this. do and um, and yeah let's just get straight into it so you can see I've got a video in my um, in my timeline right there with a little bit of music and this music's just got a couple of keyframes and all it is is fading in and fading out I've showed you how to do that before so really simple to do so I'm just gonna um, I'm just gonna go ahead now and add my logo to my video we'll do this by selecting mixer um, Selecting the video that you are selecting the image that you want I suppose you could even have a picture in picture in in here as well So you could have like a, a, another video. I'll do that in another tutorial how to do picture in picture But um, essentially adding an image is just adding picture in picture really um, So I'm just gonna drag this image out to the length that I want it to be and then um, If I want to adjust it, I'm just gonna use my fingers and pinch and squeeze um, my um, the size of adjustment of the image so if I want to make it bigger I'm just gonna pinch and squeeze and make the image a little bit bigger and I'm just gonna center it out and you can see how I've centered it out by using these um, these these guides these sort of um, arrow got or image guides center guides on the um, on the outside of the image and they're also on the outside of the screen as well so um, just release my finger from there and that's what I want to start the image with um, I'm not going to fade it in or do anything like that. I'm just going to leave the image as it is there. But then what I want it to do, I want it to um, decrease in size and float off to the to the top right hand corner. So at the time I want it to do that, I am um, I'm going to make sure I've got the image selected in the timeline. So that's highlighted in the timeline. And then I'm just going to select a keyframe, this little bottom right hand side um, diamond here. Select a keyframe. So that just means that I'm going to start something, some type of animation. And I'm going to scroll along however long I want it to take me. And then I'm going to reduce in size and move it to the location that I want to move it to. And then that is really simple, and that is really easy, and that's um, as simple as it is to to move that um, to move that logo. So if we play through the timeline now, okay. So all now we're going to do is we're going to reverse this. So um, right away, one of the problems I can see that we're going to have is you notice the word U is the color black. So when we um, and I've extended this image of the YouTube PNG over. The, um, the end of the video so we're gonna go to a black screen so you're not gonna see the U so I'm just gonna make this shorter by dragging it back to my timeline like so um, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just reverse the process we did before by um, adding a keyframe and then go to the end of the video and dragging my logo back to the center wait till I get the um, and then making it larger um, and that really is as simple as it is. Obviously, you can do different animations. You could have a, add add an effect to that animation. Um, but I, again, I can I can do that in a in another video. So as simple as it is, we just play through that. So like I said, really really simple, and um, and you can do it in seconds. So I hope this helps you out. Stick a a, a, a watermark over your videos, or um, it could even act as a as a as a sort of mini intro, I suppose. So thanks a lot for watching. Um, take care. Speak soon.